This isn't up for debate, child. Now go to sleep. This isn't fair! One of you gets to sleep in a bed, but I have to sleep on a big dumb stone! The altar keeps you safe, my child. It's for your own protection. But... Couldn't you keep me safe, brother? I am keeping you safe. But... We are not having this discussion right now. The gods have given you a place of rest. That's more than what the average paladin gets. Take their offering, child. They aren't as generous to anyone else. Okay. I don't like this. Look, I did the best I could, alright? You ruined my sword. It feels completely off. It complements your fighting style. Like hell it does. I feel like I'm swinging around a toothpick with a bag of shit stuck to it. Careful, brother. You're starting to sound creative. <sighs> What's the matter, brother? You think my whip will make me a better forge master than you? Not in the slightest. The idea of you becoming a forge master is laughable on a good day. <sighs> Well, you never know. If this is how you make a sword, I imagine I could catch your rank pretty quick. Uh, just deal with it, will you? He's enjoying this way too much. Typical. Well, in any case, he's almost done. After the last few charges are placed, we'll be able to clear a path through this forest for the ship to move. And then afterwards, I'll have a talk with Albus about changing the course heading. Oh, please. My way was faster and you know it. Your way would have us encountering 80 different anomalies that were all at threat level black. And your way would have meant waiting around for God's knows how long and hoping nothing finds us. What kind of plan is that? The kind of plan that won't get us killed in an eldritch forest. Better to die fighting than to die stalling. What kind of logic is... What the... Albus! <clears throat> There's something out there with you! <clears throat> something big! Oh, you don't say. I think I'm gonna need a bigger sword. How does a broadsword sound? You're actually gonna use it this time. We don't have much choice. Nope. Guess not. Hey! You big fucking thing! Over here! And lo, the warrior turned to the hideous monster and yelled, Hey, you big fucking thing. Truly the stuff of legends. That's it, look this way! Come on, turn around- Whoa! Okay, that is a massive- Albus stopped staring at it- Wow, okay, that is- yeah, you see it too, right? I'm just confused. I mean, how does one even... You know what? I don't want to know. I do. Now is not the time. Oh, come on. It's not like the thing is moving very far. Albus? Albus! Oh. I'm here. Oh, I'm here. Calm down. Oh, fuck me sideways. That was close. All right. No more distractions. Big boy or not, the fucker tried to kill me. As far as I'm concerned, that's a death sentence. Let's dance! He's climbing up the back side? Ah, I see what he's doing. Albus, I'll let you know when you're within firing range. Sister, can you help me? Albus set a timer on it when he shot himself out of a broadsword, but this will be different. You aim, I'll shoot. Come on. No, no! Fucking death swing me off. That's it. That's it. Almost there. Okay. Hey! You see me over there? Let's see. Yes, I see you. All you need to do now is bring it into range. Oh, that's all, eh? Anything else while I'm doing the impossible? Just do it! Okay. Sister, aim a little more to the left. Okay, now bring it down a hair. Firing! Oh shit, my sword is stuck. 
No, fuck this. Who it is it? It's dead! And the ship is covered in viscera. Great. Albus, are you still breathing? Thanks for your concern. Oh, yes, I'm fine. Covered in shit. But I'm fine. Good. When you're done, come on back to the ship and we'll set off the charges. Yes, sir. By the way, sister, did you want to say a blessing before the detonation? These are holy charges after all. It would make sense for a member of the faith to give blessings to them. Alright then. Let's wait for Albus to get back and then- I'm back. Perfect timing! The sister was about to bless the charges. How long is that gonna take? Really, Albus? I just fought my way through a horde of bone drinkers and an eldritch giant. If there's anything I missed out there, those charges are gonna be sabotaged by the time you're done praying or whatever you're doing. Oh, it'll be fine, I'm sure. Wait, where's your sword? It blew up. What?! It got stuck in the giant, okay? I couldn't get it free. Well, where are you going to get another one? I don't know, storage maybe? Ah, uh, I can't believe this! <laughs> Faithful, why don't you go ahead and start your blessing before Vinny's head explodes? Well done, sister. I must say, that was quite a passionate blessing. Hmm. <laughs> That's all you have to say? <laughs> what do you want from me? It was good, alright? A man of few words. All right, I'm setting off the charges. There we are. One river wide enough for us to pass. That doesn't sound good. Hold on, let me check the scanner. Huh. What is it? We've uncovered a gravesite beacon. The forest must have been masking the signal. I'm copying the beacon data. Might be interesting to see whose grave it is. I doubt it. Vinny, come on, we really should be moving on. There we are. This isn't a paladin I recognize. What about you, sister? Lots of paladins pass through your temple on the way to the mantle, correct? Is she someone familiar to you? Sandy. Did you say something, Albus? What? No, no, I, I didn't. Um, we should, um... We should move on. Right, of course. I may need a few minutes to course correct, but we'll be moving within the hour. Good. Ah, oh, good. You know, the longer I spend time with him, the easier I find it to read his face. Sister, why don't you go and find him? I have a feeling he's going to try and leave the ship without anyone knowing. He might need some company. I'll stay here, keep the engines warmed. Good luck, sister. Hey. <laughs> don't bother hiding, I know you're here. Devlin figured me out, didn't he? That's why you're here, right? It's not a good thing, you know. If he figures out I'm not the monster he thinks I am, he'll be really confused. He'll also be dooming himself in the eyes of the family if we become friends. <laughs> you know what amazes me the most? Despite all we've been through, you somehow remain completely adorable. How do you manage that, eh? How do you keep that up? How do I keep going? Well, I, I, um, I just ignore it all and focus on what's important. So what's important about this, she says? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing at all. It's why you need to stay here while I do this. Focus on your own thing. You'll be safer that way. Seriously? You're not gonna relent, are you? You can be really stubborn sometimes. Anyone ever told you that? What are you even going to do when we get there? Pray? <laughs> Again? <laughs> oh, fine. You can come. But... We need to be fast. Okay? So if you slow me down, you're going back. You got it? All 
right, here we go. Where are you going? Oh, you know, just thought we'd have some fresh air, have a quickie, and be back before you noticed. Sure, whatever. Just be back soon. <laughs> Thank you, brother. You're... you're welcome. Oh, damn. All right, this way. Oh, go on then, ask your questions. Stop that. I know you have questions, don't play dumb. I can see it on your face. And besides, do you really want to walk in awkward silence? Where are we going? A grave. Have you not been paying attention this whole time? Whose grave? <clears throat> my, um, my night trainers. We've uh, talked about it before, you know. Night Sergeant Sandiver. The recruits call us Sandy. You know, because of the... <laughs> you know what? I shouldn't have to spell that out for you. Was I fond of her? No, not really. But she hated me less than most. She used to pick on me in the ranks. Albus, you're up first. Albus, fetch me my sword. Albus, see me in my quarters. <laughs> you know, maybe the reason she hated me less than most is because I knew my place. Most of the bastard children in my company thought they still had something to hope for. <laughs> Sandy fucking hated that. Means they aren't broken yet. So when someone like me comes along who knows I'm just a slab of meat, both physically and... Physically? <laughs> well, Sandy really couldn't get enough of me. Did I like her? <laughs> well, in time I learned to love her. And then... I unlearned. What do I mean? Oh, I just mean... Sometimes you go through things that... Make you realize what being worth nothing really is. Some people may think they know what that's like, but, uh... Anyway, it doesn't matter now. Hmm? Oh! My ring necklace. You like it? Yeah, I found this ring back in my training stash. No idea where it came from. Not sure what, but, uh... It felt special to me. So I kept it. Hey, didn't you hear me? It was in my stash, I didn't steal it. Besides, no one seemed to care anyway. Can you see it? Oh, sure. Let me just, uh, take it off. Yeah. Yeah, no markings or anything, just a gold ring. Strange, isn't it? It's like it doesn't belong anywhere. It doesn't fit in. It's, uh, kind of like you, isn't it? Huh? Oh, I didn't say anything. Can, um... Uh, can I have it back now? I know you're not gonna steal it, I just... Uh, I, I don't feel right without it. Thank you, Faithful. I, uh, forgive you. Oh, uh, nothing. Just, um... I wanted to say, uh... You apologized to me a couple days ago. Remember? For the whole... Pushing you thing? Yes, I know, it was a while ago, but... You, you seemed upset about it, so... This is me, forgiving you. No, I'm not doing this for my own benefit, I just... Oh, oh, never mind. It was stupid anyway. No, no, come on. Moment's passed. There's no point. Okay, okay. I'm forgiving you because... I hate seeing you sad. And the last few days, uh, whenever you look at me, I just... I can't... I, I just... Do you know why I call you Faithful, and not Sister? No, it's not because you're a woman of Syndergorn. 
It's because you do have faith. Despite what anyone says, you aren't faithless. I know you still have faith, because against your better judgement, you have faith in me. Despite everything I've taught you about not trusting me or anyone of my kind, you're still here. You're still standing with me. So, you know, it's the least I can do. To forgive you. I'm still here to protect you. That hasn't changed. Okay? And just so you know, this isn't me going soft. Understand? It's a mutual respect. Good. I'm glad you see it that way. No, no, of course not. I wouldn't want that. Right, yep, it's just a job. No funny business. Yep, glad we're on the same page. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, hey, look at that, we made it. <laughs> hey, thanks for coming with me. I didn't realize how much I needed this. It's, um, nice. It felt good. Just to talk. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for talking to me. <sighs> okay, that felt weird. Moving on. <laughs> Jeez. Isn't this supposed to be a shallow grave? Feels a bit more royal than I was expecting. I don't know. Just feels like it's too much. Oh well. We're here now. I, uh... Guess I should say something. Ah, <sighs> damn. What should I say? Hmm. Okay, this might sound stupid, just so you know. I'm really not used to this. Um, hey there, Sandy. Did you miss me? <laughs> I bet you did. You know, I often wondered what I'd say to you if I ever saw you again after... After what happened. Who knows? Maybe they were lying. Maybe you'd have actually believed me if I had told you. Well, no way of knowing now. I think I know what you'd say though. Warrior's code. We don't think, we fight and we fuck. At the end of the day, that's all we're going to be good for. If you know something you shouldn't, you keep that cute mouth of yours shut. Eventually, you'll forget it even happened. <laughs> if only. Well, I'd uh, say it was good seeing you again, but uh, we'd both know I'd be lying. <laughs> See you around. Alright, that's all I got. The Kansas Black Knight. That's what they called her, I think. She told us Kansas Knights have certain creeds about burials. We are buried with honor and steel. <laughs> I'd be amazed if she had any honor, Sandy, but, uh... Let's see if there's any steel. Faithful, um... You may want to turn away from this. What am I doing? Oh, nothing, just, uh... Checking something. It looks like I'm grave robbing. <laughs> Is that so? Wow, that's crazy. <laughs> Look, she's fucking dead, okay? I think I deserve something for all the shit she's put me through. What the? <laughs> shit! Faithful, get behind me! <laughs> Heart rippers. A lot of them, too. They're acting as your guardian, Sandy. I don't think they approve of me. Or maybe... This is one final test from you. Eh? <laughs> Let's see if you can actually help me this time. <clears throat> Aha! I know this sword. Always had it in your bedchambers, but you never used it, did you? 
I even started thinking it was fake. Well, let's see how fake it is. Faithful, stand back. Oh, holy shit! That felt good. Oh, fuck me. That's better than sex. Oh, this feeling. Oh, this must be what bloodlust feels like. It's enough to make a man sick. Come on then! Let's fucking go! This... This feels so good. I can barely think. Oh, my mind is going blank. What's with that look now, Faithful? You look like a scared animal. So out of place here. I'm not done with you yet! I hate it. <laughs> I wish you wouldn't look at me like that. Ah! Ah! You broke my leg. <laughs> Good. I thought this was getting too easy. Ah! But we don't always get what we want, do we? Besides, this is who I really am, isn't it? A broken arm too, huh? <laughs> I don't think you understand what you've done. I fight a lot better like this. It has to be. What else is there? Another arm too, huh? Come on. Try and kill me. You know you want to. Damn. I think I'd be lying if I said I could still win this. Yes! What's the matter? Never seen a warrior fight without a shield? You know what it means, right? <laughs> Come on! Is that the best you've got? A warrior with no shield has no reason to live. That's why you never gave it to us, right, Sandy? Look at all of you. Monsters by any other name. <laughs> but I don't see monsters here. I just have to keep fighting. Come on! I'll show you what a real monster looks like! Why? Why? Why am I fighting? Why am I even here? Oh, fuck you taste good when you die! Oh wait. Well, I was... I think I was... Protecting... Something. Right? That's a good boy! Scream for me! Scream! No, that... That can't be right. The only one worth protecting here is... Yeah. Faithful! Hold on! I'm coming! So that's why they call them... Hot Rippers. Where... Where are they going? What's wrong? You scared of something? You better be. You... You better be. Faithful? This is your chance to run. Leave me here. Leave me... with the monsters. No. No, it... It's, it's, too, it's far too late for me. Hey, look. Look at me. Look at me. Don't be scared, okay? This... This was gonna happen eventually. We always knew this. But you... You have a chance to live. And I'll be damned... If you don't take it... Go... Go... Before they come back! I knew you were doing something stupid! A heroic death, brother! How very noble... Oh, seriously? Oh, you couldn't just let me die now, could you? Oh, I hate you both so much. 
So, are either of you going to tell me what in the hell happened? Uh, like I said, just uh, popped up for a quickie. You're really joking around at a time like this? Are you nuts? Why were you fighting heart rippers? And where did you get that sword? Uh, uh, hey, Vinny? What? Just uh, shut up already. Even half dead, you still don't want anyone to help. Typical. Absolutely typical. It's amazing how little you appreciate everything we've just gone through for you. You put the sister's life in danger. You tried to get yourself killed. The least you could do is show some gratitude. But apparently that's just too much for Big Bad Albus. Can't you see we're trying to look out for you too? Albus? Albus! Sister, he's not breathing! Where am I? Hi there, it's GB. I hope you enjoyed the video. Before we end for today, I'd like to showcase some of the art made by the patrons. If you'd like to get your art shared on the channel, be sure to join the Discord and subscribe to my Patreon. Thank you.